Welcome back, I'm Coach Rose, and today let's talk about the double jab. This is a combination you'll learn early, before your first fight, and you'll use it throughout your boxing career. Keep in mind, when you throw these two jabs, you want there to be some space in between. You don't want them to be close together, like this. Because that's too much like one jab. There's nothing on the second jab. So when you throw it, you're going to throw it out bring it all the way back to the starting position and then bounces back out again. It doesn't stop, it keeps moving, but it does come all the way back. The main reasons I like that space is because when your opponent is blocking your first jab, you're catching him as he brings his hand back to his face. He blocks the first one and then you catch him right here or if he's slipping your first jab, then you're catching him as he comes back with the second jab. If you're throwing it too close together, it's too much like one jab. So you're less likely to land the second one. When he picks, he's just gonna pick both at once. Or when he slips, you're throwing it so fast, he's gonna slip both at the same time. Okay, so let's get to it. Relaxed and balanced. When you throw this jab, there's two steps. You're going to be pushing off your back foot on both jabs. Just like that. The double jab has a lot of value. Just like the jab, the triple jab, double jab, it doesn't matter. The jab helps you control the action, it scores points, and it also sets up other punches. As always, work on your technique first in front of the mirror, and then you can make your way over to the back. Train hard, and I'll see you next time.